Hi, welcome to Genie in a Bottle. I'll be right back. I gotta go turn this old TV off. Sorry about that. You guys know I always end up uh, leaving that TV on sometime. Let me turn these Cheetos up the right way. Welcome, 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 everybody. Let's see, let's get it up here right. You don't want to stay up. Okay, and this natural cheese. I want y'all to see this a little bit better, so I'm just going to bring this down maybe a little bit. No, oh, no, they ain't going to do it. Keep it up. And, uh, got to see it. Want it to be so dark. I need some help. I need some help, y'all. I am in a need of help. It's coming. It's coming. Well, anyway, today I have the Tasty Mafia Challenge. I have vanilla ice cream. She had to eat these ice cream, but I got vanilla ice cream. And then, y'all know I like a good deal, so I had to go a little cheaper. But uh, I like Edie's ice cream, too. But that's the ice cream I got today. And then I have Fritos, nacho cheese sauce, mild cheddar sauce. And then I have these flaming Hot Cheetos. And these other Cheetos in the background, just some extra ones if I want to eat some. So how are my blessed babies doing? I hope all is well, even if it's not all is well. Yes, all is well. I was just sitting here thinking, I, uh, from a couple days ago, I said, now how is I'm going to do this challenge here? I didn't said I'm going to do it. So I like to be a woman of my word and uh, do it. She did... Uh, Oreos and sardines ones the one I had, but I didn't challenge her to it. Uh, G Mama World challenged her to it, and so, uh, but she did it. So today I'm doing hers, and uh, we're gonna start. It ain't gonna be a real long video today, but I'm gonna go on and start it. I'm gonna put some of these in there. Put some on the bottom. Let me move this stuff so y'all can see. These little flaming hot things. Ooh. And then, she can eat hot stuff, I think. Ooh. Okay. Take this off the ice cream. Should have got a scooper, but I don't really eat ice cream that much, so I don't really have a, you know, ice cream. Ice cream scooper. So that, that should be enough right there. So I'm just taking my time because I don't go off of my fast until 3 o'clock. So I'm trying to let time go on by. So I got to be faithful to that, y'all know. But I don't want to get the video out so, so, so late. Okay. I like this kind of Fritos cheese. So that's the kind I got. I don't think she of mine. Okay, let me just pour some out here. Pour some of this in here. Okay. Okay. Mm. Oh, it's that back up by up. For now. Sit that there. And put this back over here. And let's see what Tasty Mafia have here. And she mixed it up together. So mixing it all up together here. Uh, I love cheese, so we're going to see how this goes. Oh. 
Okay. Just getting together here, y'all. Think I might got put. I'm so thick. Seem like I got to put a little more ice cream. Well, I'll just do it like this. Ooh, should have probably. Oh boy, we're gonna start this thing off by praying. I'm fasting. I, uh uh. <laughs> Not today. Not today. Mm mm. Okay, let's start off. Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord Jesus, I just like to thank you, Lord Jesus, for waking each and every one of us up into the land of the living one more time. Lord Jesus, I ask that you bring nourishment to my body with the food I'm about to receive. Lord, I ask that the people who's getting ready to eat with me, Lord Jesus, you bring nourishment to their body, Lord Jesus. Lord, I pray for anything, Lord Jesus, that if someone is asking you for, Lord Jesus, that you deliver, Lord Jesus. Father God, I ask you to bless, Lord Jesus, the food, Lord Jesus. I ask that you bless us in the season, out of seasons, in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Oh, this stuff look. Ooh. Let's sit here. Y'all see that? Y'all think I need some more ice cream in here? I think I need more ice cream, a little hot. Hmm? Mm -hmm. That's good. Maybe because I love cheese. Mm. Not bad, Tasty Mafia. Yeah, I got to go over and check her channel out. <clears throat> yeah, excuse me. Yeah, I got to go over there and check her channel out, Tasty Mafia. So not only does she have, uh, I, I believe she said a seven-day challenge that she's going to be having. So this is one of the ones that I'm doing is this one right here. But let me stop talking before this be that melted on me. But go over and check Tasty Mafia channel out. And this is her challenge. Shout out to you. Mm. It's not bad. Mm -mm -mm. My mind was telling me today to do it tomorrow. But I said I might as well go on and do it. And get it over with. And that's what I'm doing. And it tastes good. Almost like a cream sipper. <laughs> This ice cream is not bad. And I got this ice cream, this vanilla ice cream, right here from Dollar Tree. And it's not bad at all. It's real creamy. I like creamy ice cream. Okay. I almost completed this. Tasty mukbangs. I seen no tasty mafia. Names is kind of close. I'm sorry about that. Tasty mafia. Mm. But both of them have so many challenges. We're just tasty mafia challenge. 
If I get a little twisted up, y'all, y'all already know. Ain't nobody perfect but God. Huh. Y'all know what I mean. Tasty Mafia. Mmm. So what I'm going to start doing, you know, what I was thinking I was going to start doing, <clears throat> I'm going to start doing a channel with just prayer. Just prayer about for five minutes. Y'all make sure y'all go check out Tasty Mafia channel. I keep saying it because some people just may be tuning in to the channel. We'll go over there and check her channel out. This is her channel. This is her challenge. Oh. Nacho cheese, mild cheddar cheese sauce, Cheetos, and vanilla ice cream. She used it Edie's. Ice cream, I believe. And uh, I'm using this. <clears throat> but all in all, it's vanilla ice cream, flaming Hot Cheetos, and cheese sauce. Okay. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. But first of all, the challenge I'm going to do is being quiet, like I said, not talking. Mm. Even if it wasn't good, it was good to me because I'm just coming off of a fast. So, oh boy, I'm doing good though. I am doing good. Yes, 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 yes. So what are all you guys doing today? You're going out, going to the mall, going to have some fun, going to the movies, going to the swimming pool. It's a nice day to go out and enjoy it. I haven't been out, but I'll be out tonight. I'll be going out, have prayer tonight, 6 to 7. And um, I got to keep on doing what I'm doing, keep on pushing and keep on pressing my way through. So if you're going through anything right now, press your way through the pain. Keep your head up above the waters. And I want to welcome each and every one of you to my channel. All the new people that's here, I want to welcome you to my new channel. <clears throat> welcome you to this new channel. Y'all get used to it. I get twisted up sometimes. Like I said, I get twisted up sometimes and um, it's okay. It's okay. It get better. It get better in time. It get greater later. But um, I explained it to some people before. I had told them uh, when you have like a thyroid um, disorder, affect people all different type of way. It happened to affect me a little bit with my sweet uh, with my speech. Sometimes it get twisted up. But the devil is a liar. By his stripes I am healed. That's why I say all is well. So don't never judge a person. You know, from the outer appearance, the cover, you know, look at what's in the inside. Because I, one thing I've learned, uh, you can be with a person for years and don't even know that person. That person, that friend of yours, could be living a devil life. And, you know, you always wonder why the person would do things, but their character didn't line up with the person they is. It's because they, they live a whole different type of life. And see, and those type of people eventually be exposed. And um, that's why I say to you guys, really get to know them that labor some monks. You get to know them. Don't be afraid to tell nobody who you is, some of your flaws, some of your disabilities. You know, it's okay because somebody always can help you. They can tell you. Well, this might work out for you, but um, you get to know people. Young people, you get to know people. You get to know that man before you put him around your kids. One Man, you get to know that woman before you put him around your kids because you don't know if that woman is abusive woman that will abuse your kids. You don't know 
what type of uh, generational curse that the man may have had and uh, then all that stuff pop up on you suddenly and then you know that's that that's a, something hard to, that's a that's a that's a big pill to swallow so I like to just forewarn some of you ladies and some of you men to always be mindful of your children be mindful of your grandchildren and be mindful of yourself and always guard your heart and always walk in love, peace, and joy. As I tell you all the time, that'll take you a long way. But I always have to come on here and give you some type of word of encouragement. And that's the encouragement is today what I just told you. Guard your heart. Get to know them that labors among you. And that was for the women, and that was the men. For the men that's on here. And um, and always love on somebody. Always do something for somebody that's less fortunate than you. You will get it back. You will get it back. Even if it's a sacrifice sometimes. To give, you know, your last dollar. Go on and give it. Go on and give it. Because I guarantee you, well, God will give it back more. And then tenfold. You just do what you got to do for your sisters and brothers that's out here that's striving. You know, it takes a lot out of a person to, for a person to um, be standing on them corners and, you know, asking for change. And stuff like that. That I mean, that take I have to take a lot out of a person. But you know, they're out here. But the thing about it is, you gotta understand: is they're sick. There's must be some type of addiction, and uh, whatever they have in these drugs is so demonic. You know, and to it's like you know, it's sickening if you can't see it. Uh, how uh, the, these drugs that, you know, these um, young people, old people, they all doing these, this type of drug, you know, they're called spike, you know. And it's having people, you know, phone from their mouth outside, people recording them like it's a joke. None of that is a joke. When you see something like that, you pray for them. You pray for the young people. You pray for anybody you see out there. You know, don't just walk by them. Go over and ask them, is they okay? Because that could be you. That could be you. You might not think it could be you. Hmm. But it could be you. Or it could be one of yours. And you don't want nobody to walk past your child. And you don't want nobody to walk past you. So you stop by and say, is you okay? Can I help you? Take that chance and give them a ride home. I have gave strangers ride home and I knew it could be consequences with it too. But I know I'm covered by the blood of Jesus and I know that Lord will get me back safe and sound without no harm or dangers. Yeah. <clears throat> That's right. And uh, I hope y'all understand what type of video mine is. Mine is Mine is not like a comedian type of video because I'm not a, a comedian. People have all types of gifts. And mine is, you know, I like to do, like I said, encourage, encourage, touch the lives of my sisters and brothers. I love to touch your lives. I like to help you. I like to uh, tell you I love you. I, I like to tell you God love you. And I like to tell you it's okay to repent for your sins. It ain't nothing too bad that you did that God can't forgive you for. He forgive you for all things. He forgive you for all things. Always remember that. Nobody is no more holier than you. Don't remember that. Remember that. Because that's what keep a lot of us home. Keep us home. And it's not only that. It's some way, time the way Christians react. And then um, they see a Christian acting like that. They don't want. To, they say, if this the way it go, I'm not. I don't want to be a part of that. But once you mature, once you start maturing in Christ, you'll be able to sit wherever 
and whenever, and you will be able to take the heat. Because guess what? That Holy Ghost will cool that spirit off of you. Because you got to know that we're not fighting against flesh and blood. But principalities. Hmm. Spiritual wickedness in high places. That's what you're fighting against. Because I done told y'all that a lot of times. And y'all hear me say the same thing. Because I wanted to marinate in your spirit. Marinate in your spirit. And I will always tell you to repent. Every day we all should repent. We always should repent. For our omission of sins and commission of sins. And that's mean unknown sins and sins that we know. So it's okay for today. Just continue to go forward. Enjoy your weekend. Be safe. And um, go over and check out Tasty Mafia. Go over there and check out our channel and um, do a challenge if you like. And that is nacho cheese, flaming hot Cheetos, and that's ice cream, vanilla ice cream. Yeah, excuse me, I'm burping a little bit, but um, I'm going to uh, end this video um, right now and I'm just going to relax and um, just going to do a little bit more praying. And maybe get on this YouTube, um, on my little channel for a little while, but, um, until I get ready to go to prayer. And, and just know, I'll be praying for each and every one of you, my blessed babies. And I pray that God take you a long, long way. Just be patient. And whatever you do, be patient. Be patient. Your time is coming in due season. In due season. Because what God has for you. He have for you. He have it for you. And always remember that in due season. You remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Love, peace, and joy to the next time, my blessed babies. Mm, there we go. You got two kisses today.